Oh man, I need a fucking haircut, dude. Bad. Alright, what's going on guys? Mercy here. And for today's video, pretty much don't really know what to do for this video to be honest, because I uh, I don't know, right now at the moment, Cold War is just really, really dry, and I honestly just don't know what to do. And also, we're on a fucking dry streak when it comes to basically clips at the moment, because I, I can't hit shit for some reason, I don't know. I mean, the fact that the game is just dying more and more and more with each passing day because of basically no one likes Cold War. And also, to top it off, there's like 100,000 kilos worth of skill-based matchmaking in this game. I'm basically playing against like the most sweatiest and like insane players in the entire fucking world. That right now, this game is just not, I don't know, it's not hitting the same anymore. Like it used to like maybe like two months ago. I mean, two months ago, I was like, at least enjoying myself in somewhat of case. But basically, I just took ended up taking the liberty to basically go into zombies and basically unlock dark ether for the ppsh 1941 or just the ppsh i don't know why it said the entire full fucking name but that's basically what it is as you all can see pretty much i ended up getting oh not this not yet right but as you all can see pretty much i ended up getting overall just dark ether for this gun and then also by the way as as you all can see i haven't unlocked plague diamond but yet i have dark ether in case any of you ever watch you know face jeb's video pretty much he explained that there's a certain amount of people within the zombies community or at least this game in general who have attempted to be you know to get dark ether eventually it would end up glitching say you got plague diamond for the snipers it would say instead of saying one of what is it like five it would say three or four of five and for me when i saw that it glitched out for me i am one of those few people who ended up getting it glitched and it's not really that big of an issue and honestly i don't really give a fuck to be honest it actually helps me because i do not want to like really like grind out all the weapons and zombies to be honest i mean i at this point i might as well because there's just nothing else to do in this game pretty much i'm just going to be playing around with the ppsh because in case you also guys didn't know that bundle pack that came with not this one the bundle pack that came with this gun ended up getting like a tracer round for basically the ppsh also for the Krig as well, but I don't really feel like using the Krig. Pretty much that's basically what we're going to do. Um, basically just use the PPSH. Nothing too fancy to be honest. I don't really feel like sniping. If I really do, I pretty much will just use this class. I'm once again using the Iron Sight because I don't know. The scopes in, for me apparently just have been feeling like extremely wonky. And I got to change this real quick. We get this and then I get basically a faster ADS. But yeah, pretty much that's all we're going to be doing. Just using the PPSH and like best place to do it is pretty much face off 6v6 because holy shit so many fucking people are playing 6v i made sure to have my fucking code name on because i am not i don't want to be seen or be recognized or even get clipped and all of a sudden oh yeah i clipped fucking mercy you know, whatever wait a minute did this game just fucking end what is this fucking game dude oh Okay, now that we're in a, a fresh, brand new game now, we can actually use this PPSH. So let's see how it actually goes out. I mean, oh man, ADS feels much better. I don't see like the really fast mag to be that important or worth it if I'm going to lose ADS speed because at this point you need as much as you can possibly get. Oh, if I pull out the- <laughs> Alright, cool. Using that cursed fucking gun, dude. Oh, okay. Let's fucking shoot bodies, that motherfucker. Dude, that is so fucking scummy, man. See, this is Cold War, man. This is why people hate this fucking game, dude. Oh, he's chasing me. Come on, chase me, buddy. I have to make sure he's dead, you know? Just had to. 
Those fucking pistols are stupid. Oh, okay, now you pull out the fucking LMG, huh? Pussy. <laughs> I tried to shoot his fucking body again. <laughs> Alright, this one was kind of enjoyable, I'm not gonna lie. How is this fucking pistol this fucking good, dude? God, why is it every fucking akimbo thing they release? How do they always just make it so fucking broken? I don't get it. Yeah, this game is just, I don't know, Call of Duty is like in a really like terrible state. I'm not saying I'm quitting Call of Duty, it's just that I'm once the more games start coming out, like Battlefield 2042, Halo Infinite comes out, I'm more open to playing those games because usually I stay in my comfort zone, which is basically Call of Duty and, well, of course, Battlefield. Wait, is this the same fucking game I just left? Hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, totally different one. Wait, yeah, totally different one. Okay. Yeah, but the fact that Battlefield. Five just did not do too hot. I'm really happy that Battlefield 2042 looks a lot like Battlefield 4, which was actually my favorite game to play. I played the fuck out of Battlefield 4 and Battlefield 3. Battlefield 3 is what my in true introduction towards, you know, the Battlefield community. I played a little bit of Bad Company, but it, by the time I was playing it, it was kind of already dead. Because Call of Duty Black Ops came out that's around that time when I first got my PlayStation 3, which and I ended up playing multiplayer. My first multiplayer experience was on Black Ops. This fucking guy, dude. Holy shit. Oh, 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 that one hurt. Why is he playing like that? Fuck, dude. Of course he... Uh, terrible caught timing. That's the one thing I hate about Call of Duty games, bro. It's just caught timing. It's just the worst. It is just so, so painful. Ooh, I low key tilted me. I'm sorry. I don't give a shit how good of a game that was. That, that, that single handedly pissed me off. My tracking was terrible right there. Wait, the spawn just flipped just like that? Oh my god, this guy came out of nowhere. See, that's the thing I really don't like about the PPSH. It doesn't really slap as hard as, say, like the LC10 or something. I'm sorry, but I have to make a video. Don't do that, please. I told you not to do that. Stop fucking drop shotting, dude. I'm just gonna hit you in the fucking head. Oh, we still lost. Uh, so that was like a sweaty ass oh, game. Wait, 
yeah, I think that's gonna be pretty much it for this video. I mean, uh, I got my two gameplays, I guess. I mean, that first game where I was just shooting the shit out of that guy's body, and I guess this game, which, I mean, to be honest, those guys were sniping. I was trying my ass off in that situation, not gonna lie, but it feels good to actually be on the other end of the stick than me being, you know, repeatedly getting the shit kicked out of me by literally people who are sweating like I just did right there. But for next video, it might be a highlight one, not too sure. I mean, I still have like a shit ton of clips that I have in my library, pretty much. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video, and of course, have a nice day. Peace out, everyone.